Hey, I'm Nixie Pixel, and you're watching OSALT, your source for open source. You don't have to pay the big bucks to get your computer running at peak performance. Here are some of my favorite open source utilities that help maximize your efficiency without minimizing what's in your wallet. Brought to you by Gamefly. Number five, Wireshark. Do you enjoy doing a wee bit of packet sniffing, perhaps? Wireshark is an excellent multi-platform application that lets you see what's going on on your network. It's also a good way to see if your neighbors are still using your internet, even though they said it would only be for a weekend. More realistically, though, you'd use Wireshark to analyze your wireless protocol to see what's causing poor performance, like if your internet just starts sucking at certain times of the day. Wireshark lets you view the contents of packets and see their source and destination, so it's a very useful program, especially if you think you may have security leaks. Read data live from Ethernet, routers, and serial ports, and feel like you came from the film Hackers, though your movie is better written. 4. Winderstat You'll probably never look at them twice, but your ancient emails, images, documents, and temporary files like to hide away and just take up space. Regardless of how old it is, I still find Winterstat to be one of the best free programs to help reclaim space on your hard drive. The colored squares that you're seeing now is a no-frills graphical depiction of the space your files take up on each drive. There's also handy color-coded directory tree maps so you can check out each file in question. From there you can decide which files are new and useful and which are old and not so much. Then you can keep them if they're needed or use Winterstat's built-in remove option. Don't worry, there is a Linux version called kforderstat, which is maintained by Fedora. 3. Gparted When I was new not just to Linux, but computing in general, I was absolutely terrified of setting up partitions. I like to configure my drives for more than one operating system, and though editing partitions is still scary, gparted makes it less so with an intuitive graphical interface. It loads into memory or runs off a CD, granting you the ability to move, resize, label, check, create, and delete partitions. If heaven forbid you lose a partition, you can use gparted to try and rescue the data. Edit partitions on all types of media, from your typical SATA drives to USB sticks and SSDs, even RAID arrays. 2. FileZilla such an awesome free and open source graphical FTP. I haven't run into any bugs during all the years I've been using it on Windows, Mac, and Linux. There's hardly a learning curve thanks to an easy to use interface with drag and drop file support. I like that you can have separate tabs for each connection you have and bookmark the sites that you frequently use for quick access. You can also manage those sites and settings. FileZilla seem to handle any big file I could throw at it, though I never tried to transfer over 5 gigs. You can even edit files remotely, like PHP and CSS, if you're dangerous like that. Number 1. Clam AV They're easy to contract, and we've almost all had them at some point in our lives. ETTD, Technologically Transmitted Disease, a virus. Funny story, I actually discovered Linux as a whole when I was using BitTorrent a lot on Windows. So I booted to Ubuntu and scanned my Windows drive with ClamAV. It's a super powerful program that detects malware, trojans, and more on all file formats, even archives. It's updated constantly, comes in more languages than I can count, and you don't have to use it from the CLI. There's a GUI called ClamTK. What's your favorite open source utility? Let me know in a comment below and I will keep it in mind for future videos. Until next time, thanks for watching OS Alt. Be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out on next Friday's episode of All Things Open Source. How much gaming can you handle? Play all the games as well as 8,000 other titles on all platforms, including unlimited PC play. With plans starting at just $15.95 a month, rent one to four games at a time and keep them for as long as you'd like. Right now I'm hooked on Max Payne 3 and that is upside down. You know the drill, once you're done blistering your thumbs on one game, just send it back and Gamefly will send you the next one on your list. If you really can't part with your game, simply click Keep It on the Gamefly website and it's yours at a discounted price. They'll even mail you the case and manuals free of charge. 
Gamefly has no late fees, no due dates, and shipping is always free. And if you're a fan of OSALT, I'm a fan of giving you a 15-day free trial when you go to Gamefly.com slash OSALT and sign up today.